Hey guys, Retro Reviews here again with another video review, and this time I'm going to be, uh, do a real quick one, the one that I've been planning on doing for a little while now, since I got these guys. This is the, uh, O's Ranger Key set from the, uh, Kamen Rider and Super Sentai crossover movie, uh, Movie War. Um, so yeah, we have, uh, Tatoba, Gatkiriwa, Latrata, Sagazo, uh, uh, Tajador, Shauta, and Putotira. And overall, very nice keys. Do like the amount of detail they put into some of these, especially Tatoba. Tatoba does have the best detailing considering he is the main form. And uh, just overall, very nice. Uh, as you can see, real quick. Side by side with him and Getsukiri Boss, since they're supposed to both have the same legs. As you can see, there's a little bit more attention to detail in Tatabas versus Getsukiri Boss. And same goes with the arms for La Tarata. So. Go ahead and do the uh, ranger key flip. And mine actually does have a little bit of a loose waist. So I've noticed I can kind of... There we go. Flick them up. And we have the uh, Tatoba logo. Go ahead and get the Mobirates and turn it on. And take the key and just plug it in like any normal key. And that's it. When you turn the key, it just says Special Ranger Key Yahoo, and then you have to push the uh, center button. And all it says is that. So, there's that. Oh, and um, Ranger Key number, this one is... Two zero eight. That's kind of cool. Um, go ahead and show off. Got the Kiriba. Very nice. I do like the green on them. Probably one of my favorite complete combos. If I didn't mention in uh, in my SH Figure Arts review of him, uh, got the Kiriba logo. Green background this time. His was black. Also, for the keys, this piece here that reads the color on the Gokai Galleon Buster and the Gokai Saber is different. They do represent whatever color is on their back. So this will be a black. This will be a black key in the Galleon Buster, and this would be a green key. And uh, this one is Ranger Key. 216. Yeah. All of them say the same thing. I'll go ahead and put the mobile away because I'm not going to do this every time for every single one when it does the same thing. So, they, they just won't fall over. All right. Anyways, La Tarata, very nice. I uh, don't really like the arms on this one all that much because of uh, the way Tataba handles the striping. Gives a little bit more detail, but I do like that head. Looks very nice. Um, he does get the tramp stamp, unfortunately. And he is Ranger Key 215. Uh, what was it? Tataba again? He was 208. Alright, now Sagozo. All new detailing for his, nothing that's repeated off of any of the other ones, so he gets away with uh, 
doing a little bit more. Uh, same bland kind of legging and uh, his gauntlets there are painted on, but they're not physically there. I do like the head sculpt. That does look pretty cool. And uh, go ahead and raise your key flip. And if you didn't notice, that's a yellow key. And this is a white one. So, uh, Sagozo logo on the back. Now, Tajador. Very awesome. I do love this head sculpt. I wish more forms would have used the uh, special uh, Taka head sculpt. But, uh, kind of bland in the uh, designing. There's no uh, lining in his gauntlets or shoulders or legs. So it's just all red striping. Uh, Tajador logo on his chest. Tajador logo on the key, and it's a red key. Uh, Shauta. Also very cool. It does have a very nice... I do love the coloring on the head. They did a good job sculpting the head, and I just admire that. It looks very nice. Um, Shachi Unagi Taco. Go ahead and do key flip. Blue key. Shauta. And then lastly, Puto Tiro, which is just, whoa. Um, very nice. I do love how they implemented the, uh, the white part of his suit and leaving it as a black key. I do actually appreciate that. It does look pretty cool. And it does match the rest of the keys. So it does look nice. Uh, go ahead and key flip. Also head sculpt. That freaking head sculpt with the pterodactyl wings coming off of it. Holy cow. And uh, Puto Tira. Ranger key flip. Puto Tira Nosaurus. He is Ranger Key 217. Shauta was 14. He was 13 and he was 18. So we have 8, 13. The key numbers are all over the place on this set. I don't understand why. So. Overall, very nice set. I can't believe it took me nine minutes to review the set, but uh, anyways, very awesome. I do appreciate this. If you like Kamen Rider O's and you have the Mobirates, I do suggest pick this up. It's fun as a collectible item, but since the uh, sound effects are limited, since it they have the same one for every one, it could get a little boring after a while, but... I do like full team sets versus the uh, Red Ranger sets I've found out, especially after the Red Ranger key set one. All of those guys got replaced in big deluxe sets with their corresponding teammates and better paint scheme. But overall, very nice. And uh, uh, that's about it, I think. So, yeah, this is Ratchet Reviews. I hope you guys like this video, and I'll see you again next time.